Well, the first thing I did was go back uh, and open the patio doors to look at the pool because the pool person had come that day and cleaned it and it always looks so nice after it's clean. And then I just stared. So, something wasn't quite right and I blinked and blinked and looked and realized that it was a sinkhole. Opening up in an Orange County backyard. Look at the scene here. Chopper 2 flying over it. It swallowed several trees, even part of a pool. And you can see that hole. It is 50 feet wide. And Los Angeles. Florida today had to do with something we're seeing a lot more of lately, and that's sinkholes. A massive sinkhole swallows several buildings in China. Swimming pools are interesting um, structures because they have this, you're, you're making a hole and Florida's uh, soil conditions are very interesting. The water tables are very, very high. And so if you start to alter it by digging into the ground and then trying to put water in and out of these pools, uh, it, can, it can cause not just depressions, but also flotation. So uh, it, we've had cases where somebody woke up and their pool was actually floating on the ground. I must be dreaming. I didn't know what to think and then I realized that there was a hole in the ground. My name is Suzanne Blumenauer and we're in Winter Park, Florida. It's a lovely setting. It's kind of an oasis, you know, out of the way. I was out to dinner with some friends celebrating my birthday. The phone rang. It was a girlfriend calling from Georgia to wish me a happy birthday. And um, I just said, Karen, I have a sinkhole. Who do I call? And her brother had been in the fire department for many years, so she immediately knew to call the fire department. So I hung up and called the fire department. Anything we built, we first do calculations about how much it's going to settle. A sinkhole is a natural phenomenon that occurs underground due to certain conditions uh, of uh, interaction between water, rock, and soil. It's essentially a subsurface cavity that grows with time. And what we know as sinkholes is essentially the surface collapse of an underground cavity. And that layer of soil on top, when you build on it, just gives, and then you have this hole. A lot of sinkholes naturally occur and become lakes. There's a very famous sinkhole not, you know, half a mile away from me, just off Fairbanks, that swallowed up Those many cars. Sports cars that landed in the hole when a garage partially collapsed, well, they're still there, slowly sinking deeper. Plans to move them out today using a big helicopter were scrapped when it was feared the helicopter would cause the hole to deepen even more. The one house that fell victim was nowhere to be seen. The wood that was once the house floated in the water at the center. Uh, for, for a long time after the Winter Park sinkhole in the 1980s, uh, we, we sort of uh, uh, took our uh, eyes off of this ball. Well, we had plenty of tremors because of the drilling that was taking place across the street for three years, I might add. Um, but I, it, I didn't investigate the pool deck or anything. Vibration causes other kind of problems uh, on foundations next to you. you have a very high vibration project going on next to a foundation. There should be somebody making sure looking at that other building. If you have an urban area and you want to continue to develop that area, the only solution really ha you have is to go back in and grout that area so that you stabilize the hole. I don't know what happened to them, but I did see um, the same. I saw grouting going on in their yard. Grouting is where you insert a mixture of soil and cement and water to try to stabilize that hole so that it doesn't grow any further and it, it can be stable as you go few into the future. I'm confident that the work that was done around this property will prevent any 
sinkhole activity until at least I'm dead and buried. All kinds of interesting things happen in Florida, and that's because of one thing, which is water. Any kind of sudden changes in groundwater conditions tend to uh, make this problem worse. There are underground cavities as we speak, and they might be one under you. <laughs>